because of this. Uh, it's perhaps a couple of hundred meters up from here to the, to the top of the hill. <clears throat> it's uh, quite a cold day actually, it's about 27 degrees. Still very damp. Let's see. It's, uh, we're surrounded by coffee plantations and similar. Uh, I don't know, they seem to have grown something here. There's a lot of trash lying around on the hill. <clears throat> see where my friends went? They went, well, I'm alone now. Uh, uh, just keep walking up here. Lots of trash. This must be it. better views when I get up on the hill. I have no idea if this is an old crater. <clears throat> this would be on the northeast side. dug out. <clears throat> Here's another one. Very big craters. Looks like the B-52 craters in the, in the Asia Valley. There's some remains here. If this is not the hill, I'm going to be very upset because it takes a lot of energy to walk up here. Another crater here to my left, which is south of me. I'm going to turn off now and just check around a little bit. Yeah, so although it's uh, quite an experience to be here, it's quite scary because vegetation is so close to the, to the trail that I can't see if there are any snakes around and I can't go down there that's impossible so perhaps I will have to try to go down that way seems to be a road around on the east side of a hill there uh, this is what it looks like looking west As I can see, there's no flat ground around here. Um, pictures I've seen it, I mean, they're old and from a completely different perspective. It seems to be more flat ground, uh, but it's hard to tell. Before I get to another slope, of course. So my friends are walking off in the distance. I'm going to spend some more 
time here. Uh, goes, I'm not sure I'll never get back up here. further down from the first ones I saw. I don't know if they were. So I'm still not certain, but I'm pretty sure I'm walking up on the east side of the hill, going, walking a little bit south, southwards or southwest perhaps. There's a ridge here coming down from the top of the hill. We're gonna try to walk up there. Depends on the vegetation. I don't know. I don't want to walk into snakes too much. <laughs> All right. So I walked down the east side now a little bit, and uh, it's my driver and guide who's walking in front of me. And here it's this uh, maybe. It's possible to make this out, uh, but this seems to be like a tongue uh, stretching out here, a small ridge coming down from the top. Uh, was it here that the battery was located on this one? I don't know. But then, uh, as you can see, it's now it's pretty much jungle here on this, on the rest of the hill stretching, stretching south down here. So uh, I think, considering. Uh, the density of the jungle here and uh, the fact that the place is probably littered with UX so we're not going to be able to walk any further I'll see if we can go and get up here a little bit but this would be oh that was a big bird took off I'm wary of sounds now because of the, the snake situation anyway this would be if I understand it where the battery was and where Lieutenant Brown ran down uh, during the night. Um, yeah, it's the end of the trail here, so uh, it's probably something from the top of the hill, but could be from the other side. Do you remember if it was this steep? Do you see? It's really, really very steep here. Um, this again is looking south. I'm gonna walk back now a little bit. My guy is waiting over there, he doesn't want to walk any further. It's not that hot. Um, this is us walking back north on the east side. Uh, on the outside of the tongue, from the, from the top of the hill. Where I would guess, but I'm being certain that that's up here was where the battery was. It's just above the, the ridge here, maybe. 20 to 30 meters up. Uh, looking down, panning down here, it's very steep. Um, you see the valley again here with the Quezon village very far away. And uh, I'm not sure you can say the combat base from here, but it's probably maybe a little bit to the left from where I'm pointing the camera now. Anyway, I'll be walking back here. There was no, no snakes the first time, so I hope there are no snakes now. We walked here. Um, let's see. I hope uh, the camera catches. Uh, can can uh, show you how steep it is here. This I don't like. Okay, made that one. Let's see, walking back, a little bit disappointed I couldn't get around the whole hill, but I didn't expect that. It's so big and with the vegetation it's uh, obviously 
not to uh, recommend really. Um, so we'll come back at the starting point up here where we reach the hill in the first place. Alright, so I decided to give it another chance. We're walking now on the north side of the hill that would be looking up towards the hill. It's difficult to see. To see if we can get around on the west side or at least find some kind of trail to get up there. Uh, which of course is impossible to know, but on the map it looks like there's, there might be a small trail there, so we'll, we'll hope for the best. It opens up here. Uh, a small hill ridge stretching a little bit north here. Um, looking up north. And palm trees, I don't know what those are. They don't look like banana trees, but I haven't seen. Uh, so they, it should be to the left here, if there's anything. Uh, really. It's easy to walk here, but the car wouldn't make it. You have to have a four-wheel drive or a big truck here. Um, so let's see what we can find. Should be something to the left because going right here, I'm not going to do like going left is the correct, the proper direction. So you see, I'm beginning to lose my guide again. Ah, I don't know if there's anything here. Um, so this would be, yeah, this would be hills. I would guess that's hills. It's only a few kilometers over to the other side. Um, big, beautiful mountain is. Uh, I'm shooting at you. And here is another. This is same hill as peanuts. I don't know how you can see. There seems to be another top here hilltop so uh, so I've never been here I don't know anything about the topography so let's see um, I'm walking a trail now down on the which would be the, the left side the west side of the hill um, oh. This is farmland, but it's still very dense and it's not properly handled, not properly managed. So, uh, let's see. There, you can see here now. Okay, there's some kind of canal. Bugs everywhere, of course. So let's see. Okay, I'm not gonna walk it further now. I've had enough. Uh, just want to show you here that there's another top. Is that part of uh, peanuts? I don't know. It seems to be. All right, so I'll turn off here and we look further. So again, this is where they're having. Yeah, it, it is banana trees. This seems to be a stretch of the hill going kind of. Uh, West, northwest. Uh, I wasn't sure about this first, but it's, it could be part of the same hill. I guess you guys have got uh, qualified to judge that. This is looking back up towards the summit of Peanuts, and where the GPS put me. And I understand now that these hills in the background there are not Laos, it's further away, so we will look at that from another uh, angle. I know a little bit more now, so we see the silhouette of peanuts 
as I think it is, uh, from the left and then wandering up the hill all the way to the summit there. I can't estimate how long it is. Is it 800 meters, one kilometer perhaps? <coughs> and the tall hill in the back, I don't know what it is. Uh, is that hill 400? That's uh, pointed out on the map also. Yeah, so walking back down the hill now uh, from uh, from LC Peanuts. Uh, been up here a couple of hours. Uh, walking east here, I can see the Kaysan village in the background, which is more of a small town now, town nowadays. Um, I'm a little bit disappointed. I couldn't see. I couldn't walk across the whole hill, but uh, I guess 50 years of growth does something. Um, but I hope that you could uh, at least, um, together with this video and uh, the pictures that I've also sent to, to Lieutenant Brown, that you've been able to recognize parts of it. So thank you for this. For now. Thank you.